Hey everyone, so I got this box in the mail today and I have an idea as to what's in here. It's from the cubicle, uh, but the box is a lot bigger than I had expected. They spelled my name in a really odd way for some reason, uh, but I'm glad I got here quickly. So let's go ahead and crack into it. So the first thing that I see here is the cubicle hat. And this is something that I asked for maybe like a year ago, year and a half ago. Uh, of course, prior to it becoming an actual product, but it looks really cool. Uh, the material is really nice. Uh, I'll definitely be wearing this at competitions around wherever. Next thing I see is the new cubicle mat. Nice. All right, so I'll definitely be using this, bringing it to competitions as well. Um, next thing I see, hey Chris. So I think this is my Volk M. Uh, I got one of these a few weeks ago, but I want another one as a backup, so they're nice enough to send me one. It's really nice. <laughs> I wasn't a huge fan of magnets for the longest time, but really grew on me and um, I didn't even think I'd be using it for one-handed, but the one that I got a few weeks ago is now my main. Uh, so they put the shades that I use on here, nice Cubicle Labs logo, yeah, and I really look forward to using this. Might actually become my main for the competitions over the next few weeks. Um, something I just randomly decided to add, um, some Mega Minx. I was never particularly good at Mega Minx, but... Um, it's kind of inspired by the records that have been broken. Um, yeah, this this cube I heard was, or this Mega Minx, I, I heard was really good. So I'm gonna play around with it, maybe get faster, maybe practice. We'll see. Uh, and this, see what that is in a second. Nice. So I didn't expect this actually. Um, so just in case you guys don't know, I am currently sponsored by both the cubicle and Chi. So, Phil, thank you so much for updating the jackets, putting both the logos on there. Uh, the white jacket, this jacket in particular, like the base jacket, is one of my favorites. I really enjoy wearing it at competitions and it just looks really, really clean. It always has my name on the back, last name. And there's another one in here. I asked Phil to throw in a bunch of business cards because I, I like to always have them handy. Uh, when I'm on campus, I always run into some like casual cubers, so it's it's always good to just kind of hand these out. Um, yeah, a lot of them don't really know about the the Cuban community, so it's good to try and help them get more into speed cubing with you know, these business cards that maybe they can order something, get a better cube. Uh, yeah, there's a bunch of them in there, so I'll definitely make use of those. Uh, and yeah, the last cube. I'm really excited for this. Uh, it just came out. Your feed is probably full of videos covering this cube, but let's crack into it. There it is. It's the new uh, Wu Choi M. And I've been using the Wu Choi for the past maybe 10 months. Yeah, since the beginning of uh, beginning of college, beginning of the school year. So let's turn it. Whoa. Oh my god. So the Volk M that I mentioned uh, that I got a few weeks ago, um, I didn't get that in the mail. I got that when I went to go visit Phil and the rest of the team at the warehouse, at the cubicles office in Westchester. Um, and this is the first package I've gotten in a while. I don't order cubes too often, but I got to try the Wu Choi M's. Um, as they're being produced. Um, I, I didn't get to try any finished product, so it's really nice to see like how much better this is, because when I tried them, they were stock, uh, no lube, like stock tensions, just as uh, as they were building them. So, yeah, I can barely feel, feel the magnets on the outer layer, but they're there. Definitely on the in inner layers. If I remember correctly, they said that they use stronger magnets on the inners and weaker on the outers, so it makes sense. 
but this cube is really really nice and uh, what a, whatever they did to set it up I'm really happy with of course the logo very nicely stickered same shades as the the Valk M these are the cubes that I got along with the hat the mat and two jackets um, so I'll probably make videos covering these so just look out for those and I'm really excited to make use of these cubes um, I'll be competing I was actually supposed to compete this past weekend in Maryland but I didn't have a ride down so I just kind of skipped um, I'll be in New York for Hudson Valley next weekend and I'll be in Lexington for the two day the weekend prior to nationals and then of course nationals in Indiana and those of you that are going to Paris, I'll see you there too. Um, gonna have a lot of competitions this summer. Um, I took a few, probably around four or five months off of competing, and um, it's good to be back. Uh, I, I hadn't practiced for a while because this semester kind of just took over my life. And yeah, it's nice to actually be practicing again. It's really cool to see what the cubicle has come out with over the past few months, the new cubes that have come out. Um, it's really nice to, to be able to make use of those, so. Yeah, I'll break these in, uh, maybe even the Mega Minx, we'll see. I'll break them in and I'll use them at the competitions. Hopefully they'll, they'll help me out. So that pretty much concludes this video. Uh, I, I don't really post too often. I wanted to a lot more this semester, but yeah, it was, it was tough. So uh, n now that I'm on break, uh, I'm working, but I'm practicing. I'll have more time. Uh, yeah, so just look out for videos on these and... Talk to you guys next time. Bye.